Hey, what's up guys? It's the True Hookah King. I just got finished heating up a charcoal, so uh, let's do this real quick. I've only seen one other review for this, so I thought I'd go out to my smoke shop and get some. My friend also has some. Uh, this is called Pink from Starbuzz. Pink. Pink. I mean, it was right next to the code 69, so <laughs> take that however way you will. Um, I mean, I guess it's one of the new flavors because it looks kind of like the pina colada one. So I guess it's like one of their new ways of, I don't know, it smells okay. Almost like a... Strangely enough, almost maybe like a, a lemonade or a bubble gum or something like that. It's really weird. Really weird to explain. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and try it right now. This is odd. Very, very different. Very odd. This is, uh, I don't know. It almost tastes exactly as it's. Wait. There's like an aftertaste. It kind of tastes like sweet, you know? Almost like after you just got done chewing bubble gum. Or maybe like right after you just had some cotton candy. I mean, it's okay. It tastes like it smells. I think. A little different. It's it's kind of like a lemonade type taste. Maybe that's what it is. It's pink lemonade. Oh my god. <sighs> yeah. That's what it is. Has to be pink lemonade. So it all depends on if you like pink lemonade. It's uh I mean, it's not it's not horrible. You know, it's good. You get nice clouds with it. I'd say I'd give pink um, out of a 10. It would have to be for Starbuzz. I think I'd I think I'd give it like a seven.
Because the more I smoke it, the more I actually start to like it. It's, um... It's, I don't want to say it's perfumey, because I don't want you to get the wrong idea. But, uh, it's not bad. It does have a, an aftertaste, like some, like moisture, like a moisture type. Almost like as if you, you uh, drank something or like bit into something that made your mouth water. Like if you just like ate a piece of bubble gum, kind of like that. It's like pink lemonade bubble gum in a way. I don't know, this one's kind of hard. It's kind of like either you like it or you don't. Um, but I'd say go for it. I, I would give it a 7. Maybe even a 7.5. But I'm just going to go ahead and give it a straight 7. Because it's actually... It's pretty good. I, I would smoke it again. Yeah, so who knows? Maybe a while after smoking it, I'll start to like it even more. I'll keep you guys updated on pink. It's the cut. I'm gonna tell you guys right now the cut. It's um, there are some pretty big pieces to it. Um, just a few, which is normal, but I mean, like this one. It's a big old huge long piece in there. Just not a it's not a big deal really. Um but yeah, that's what it looks like. So yeah, if you know, smell it and if you like it, try it. But I mean don't just take one puff and be like, oh this is crap, you know, hit it a couple times. Cause uh I actually enjoy it. Uh, make sure that you look at the True Hookah Queens channel because she should have some stuff posted really soon. Um, also, keep an eye out because soon I should have uh, another smoke shop review for you guys. So Keep that in mind. Until then, this has been the True Hookah King. Happy smoking to all my hookaholics. Till next time.